much for now. Thank you. Well, joining us now from our studio in Chelmsford is Hassan Hassan. He's the co-author of ISIS, Inside the Army of Terror, and has extensively studied so-called Islamic State. Hassan, uh, what do you make of the significance of, first of all, of Mwazi himself? Because he wasn't a leader, was he? No, he wasn't, but he was, a, he was an important person uh, within ISIS, especially, you know, uh, around the borders of uh, the so-called Islamic State. Um, the, he's, uh, he's not only a guard, he actually handles some, um, uh, some important kind of logistics about uh, moving prisoners, especially hostages, uh, uh, Western hostages. Uh, it's, uh, it's quite significant, I mean, uh, especially for, uh, it's good news for everyone, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's quite significant that uh, uh, they managed to kill him. That indicates that uh, the um, U.S.-led coalition is getting more, uh, uh, like, getting better at uh, gathering intelligence on the ground, which is, you know, good news. However, I don't think it's, you know, it's bad news for the organization itself. He's a, you know, he's an indispensable, uh, he's, a, he's a dispensable person just like any other um, uh, person who has joined ISIS over the past few, uh, few years. These people, you should always remember that, uh, you know, the, these people are not part of the core of the organization. There are special forces within the organization that they always keep uh, away from uh, the front lines, from obvious public, um, you know, places. Uh, but it's, it's quite significant that they managed to, uh, to kill him. It's good news for uh, the families of the victim, for everyone. Uh, it's, a, it's a kind of a, a blow against the regime, uh, sorry, against the, uh, the, the group um, uh, internationally or international kind and of image. Uh, do, you, do you think it will have a, I mean, how, how would one judge the morale of an organization like ISIS? I mean, if we heard that the Americans are saying this was a, a routine operation, we're killing people of that kind of caliber every couple of days, uh, does it have an impact on the morale, do you think? I, do, I don't think so. I mean, these, uh, uh, these uh, you know, members who join ISIS, uh, you, should, uh, you know, we should emphasize that um, join it because they, they either w are seeking uh, martyrdom, they want to die uh, for the sake of the group, so death is not really a big factor. Uh, uh, you know, the, the most important uh, thing for the group is, uh, is uh, keeping territory and uh, uh, expanding elsewhere. And uh, I think the, 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 the bigger pr probably uh, what makes the news um, about the killing of Amazi uh, more, uh, more of a problem for ISIS is the, the, the defeats that we've seen, uh, especially during this week, of ISIS in both Iraq and Syria. So uh, th this is the sort of things that uh, matter for... Uh, you know, for, for ISIS. Uh, I, is, I is, was going to say, uh, to, yeah. Uh, yeah, sorry to interrupt, but I was going to say, would you think then, uh, although obviously there's huge interest in uh, uh, the, the killing of this, this man because of the brutality uh, that he exhibited, do you think that uh, the fact that ISIS has been in retreat around Sinjar, for example, and Kurdish forces appear to have taken the town, do you think that's a more important blow against them because they're losing ground? Yes. Uh, so uh, if you uh, combine all these uh, things that have been happening over the past, you know, just one week, I don't think, uh, like before the group was doing uh, well in, uh, in Aleppo and in, in Iraq, in both Iraq and Syria. Um, but uh, the, 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 the kind of the combination of all these factors, the, the, the killing of Amwazi, the, the defeat in Sinjar, and also today we, we, uh, we just heard that uh, ISIS has been defeated also in, in southern Hasaka. Uh, all these things are demoralizing for the group, and it's, uh, uh, it shows that the group is not uh, as uh, you know, all-powerful as it seems for outsiders. So this matters for people who are watching from outside Syria and Iraq and uh, considering maybe joining the group or not. And, and once they see the group is... Uh, uh, is, is defeated or is being defeated or is, is kind of rolling, uh, is being rolled back in some areas, uh, that uh, affects the image of the group and its in international uh, image. Hassan, Hassan, thanks very much for sharing your expertise with us.